Um, hi, Chelsea Cat. I don't remember what I showed you guys the last time. Let me just show you. So this is the the bedroom. We've decided to um, to get rid of the drywall because there was drywall um, in here. So we got rid of the drywall and we have brick now. And then as you enter, the shower is very dark. I hope the camera can adjust the lighting. But this is basically where the shower is. We have a niche. There is the first one. And the other one is on this side so remember this is gonna be a double shower so that's why we have two so the shower is almost done we have this little step that we added here so that we can add the framing the marble framing you, you guys will see once it's done I feel like I'm struggling to to explain like exactly because I don't know the correct terms um, but we've just added that step here and you guys will see I'll show you I'll, I'll just show you guys a picture of how it's going to look like and then this side you guys can see it's still open the reason why this is still open is because they still need to fix them we basically decided to fix the entire like to change the entire plumbing of the house so yeah that's why this is opened this is a very old geezer there's two geezers in this house the other one is outside uh, so we have planned to disconnect this one because it's very old and i think it's leaking so yeah this one is no longer going to be working we'll only be using the one outside which is working perfectly fine uh and also i think it's not like a good idea to have your geezer inside in case it leaks and the entire house is going to be flooded um but yeah so there's just a lot of there's a lot going on in here and also remember this is a very old house so there's just like weird things <laughs> um but yeah anyway i wanted to show you this area so this area is going to be like our little uh makeup hair station so this is where we will be doing our hair i just want that area to be separated from uh from the main vanity so it's going to be here because we already have the space and it's not like a huge um like a huge area you don't need a lot of space for that so it's going to be here i'll show you guys a picture of the inspo that i saw on pinterest um and then this side is where the staircase is as you guys can see this is the ceiling um, of that staircase and this is the main reason why we had to change our layout uh because we couldn't do anything in here so we'll only be using this as like um storage so that's basically the only thing we can do in here and then this is the main bathroom so this is where the bathtub is going to be um on that side we haven't really decided where the toilet is going to go previously the, um, the toilet was there um and then this is where our vanity will be the double vanity because we don't have enough space i would have loved um for the vanity to be here but it cannot be here because the bathtub is very big so we won't have enough space for it so it's gonna go back here but yeah this is basically where we are um later today we are going to go and get towels the guys will be coming again tomorrow and also i forgot to tell you about that door uh, it's just gonna be an arched opening so there's not gonna be a door in here it's just gonna be like an arched opening so we still need to get plywood so they can remove the frame um and fix the arch I want to show you guys the two tiles the samples that we have we have this room is a mess there's the bathtub we have it covered I'm not sure if I've shown you guys but here is the bathtub I've covered it because I don't want them to scratch it but yeah this is the bathtub i don't think i've shown you guys i don't think oh i also didn't show you guys the clicker it has the um, I think it's here so this is the clicker it's in polished brass this is the clicker we were waiting for I came here to show you the tile, the tile samples. 
so these two samples uh, I got I think maybe like a few months ago maybe in Jan or Feb I got these two samples and I think at that time I think at that time I was starting to think about the the bathroom reno but we had not like started anything so I got these two samples just to just to have them because <laughs> uh, I was really excited so I got these two samples I think this one is from I don't remember which one is from Union Tiles, but I remember the one from Union Tiles was very expensive. I want the herringbone pattern. So this tile might work, but the only issue with this tile is that it is very long. The tile I'm looking for, it needs to be maybe like up to here so that it looks nice. Um, so yeah, I don't know if I can find anything like that, but we'll see when we get to the stores. I think the next time I talk to you guys will be when we go to the to the stores to look for these tiles, uh, but we cannot go until my superfluous order is delivered, so I'm still waiting for that. So this is my outfit. I'm wearing these, these pants from Mango. Oh, my neck is from Mango. Hat is from Mango. The bag, you guys know this bag, it's also from Mango. Just got back home. My superfluous order got delivered while I was um, while I was away, so I'm going to quickly unbox it with you guys. I placed this order because I wanted this waistcoat. I've been wanting this waistcoat, but this one was sold out. I only got the, um, the one in black. I couldn't get this color. So I put it on my wish list and yesterday I saw that it was back in stock but I also got like some some other things. I don't remember what other things I got. I think it's a pair of earrings and what else did I get? Oh these earrings are so tiny. Actually no. I'm happy with this size. So I got these earrings from Mango. Oh, this is stunning. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, these are so stunning, you guys. Wow, this is really nice. This is really nice. Um, yeah, I got these earrings and then Inside this box, there is my waistcoat. I think, and what else did I buy? I don't remember what else I bought. Oh, <laughs> this waistcoat. So, this waistcoat is from HM. I have the same waistcoat in black. So I've all, I, I actually when I got the black one, I wanted to get this cream one as well, but this one was sold out in my size. Um, so it came back in stock yesterday, so I placed an order. And I really, really love this. Um, yeah, I really, really love it. It's very plain. I also love that the back is not this um, silk material because most of them, um i saw the one from mango it has the silk material at the back which i don't like and then i'm not sure to be honest i should have gotten this i wanted to get a medium but the medium was sold out so i got a small i don't know if it's gonna fit because my head is very big but i got this is it a visor is it a visor but i got this head absolutely love it i've always wanted to get it i don't know why i'm only getting it now but i've always wanted to get it it's this visor i think it's a visor and it feels amazing oh yeah this is wool it feels really nice let me try it on guys please please ignore oh my god i should have gotten here 
I should have gotten a medium. Okay, it doesn't it doesn't really look nice. <laughs> yeah, the small is not comfortable. I need to get a medium. This is a very beautiful shade of green. Um, it has this knob. I don't know if I should call it a knob, but yeah, it's really nice. I think this color is khaki. What color is this? But yeah, I really love this, but unfortunately it's very small. I need to get a medium. Uh, but yeah, that is basically all I got from that's basically all I got from Superbless. I'm really happy with these earrings. They're so cute. So this thing is very heavy. I'm sure you guys still remember this mixer <laughs> that I got from Facebook Marketplace. Ooh, it's so heavy. This mixer that I got from Facebook Marketplace, it's a bath mixer and it's very old. I don't remember which one is cold and which one is hot. I was actually at home when my boyfriend sent me this picture and I could not believe um, that this was the same mixer that was in, I think it was Antique Brass. Yes, it was Antique Brass. Yeah, they did an amazing job, you guys. I was so, like, I was super impressed. This is the, the sprayer. Even here inside, it's polished. Like, I don't know what exactly they use to polish these things, but yeah, they do an amazing job. Like, I was really, really, like, super impressed. Um, this is for, like, holding your, your thingy. It stays like this. But yeah, I'm really, really happy. It's so beautiful. I They do an amazing job, but I honestly wouldn't recommend them because of their service. Like, their service is horrible. Like, their customer service is horrible. I don't know if they don't care or this is, like, how they treat everyone, but they just don't, like, care. Even if, like, they, they've done something wrong, they don't apologize, you have to follow up with them all the time. They don't reply to emails. You just have to always call them. It got to the point where I was so fed up. I was so annoyed. I just stopped like talking to them. I just asked my boyfriend to handle everything because I was really annoyed. In terms of the work that they do, brilliant. I really wanted to use like um, a different company, but they were the only option I had. I couldn't find other companies that um, that polish um, items like this. I did check Victorian bathrooms because I really love Victorian bathrooms, guys. They've never like they haven't disappointed me. Everything that I ordered from them is exactly what they advertised. So even their service, like it was amazing. Um, so yeah, but unfortunately they don't. Um, they said they don't do. They don't provide that service. Um, but yeah, I think we paid one point. 1.9 for this to get it polished yeah 1.9 for this to get it polished from antique brass to polished brass and as you guys can see like they did an amazing job like you wouldn't believe that it was like i still cannot believe that this was the same mixer that was like it looked very old it looked really bad um but it looks amazing now i also did polish these um these beep tabs, I did polish them. These ones, I used um, the brass polisher. Um, but these will be for the kitchen. Guys, it is the next day. I wanted to quickly show you guys. We got uh, we got the Tide from CTM. I haven't shown you guys. I want to show you just now. We got it from CTM. It's the wood look Tide. So, we want to see how it's going to look in um, a herringbone in a herringbone pattern so this is the, um, the tile we got um, I think the name is honey honey oak or something so I decided to go for this one because I feel like it's gonna work for the space because um, I just wanted to tone things down I think it's the perfect uh, shade this one is slightly big but I mean, we had no other option. This was the most affordable one we could find. I'm gonna get dressed and... Hi, baby! Hello, my love. Hello, blue, blue. <laughs> and then, there's Chelsea. He's busy eating. I know you guys are tired of this hat, but I'm sorry. I'm gonna be wearing my hat every day. What 
hand to show you. I'm not sure if it's this one. My boyfriend got me this um, this fragrance from Jo Malone. I'm struggling to open it. Ouch! 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 is the box from Jo Malone. Um, I've always wanted this um, this fragrance. It's Scarlet Poppy. And it smells divine. Mm, it smells so beautiful. Packaging is really beautiful. It's not black. It's actually um, a very, very dark cherry red. But yeah, anyway, it's a very dark red. It's not black. And I've actually tried this scent before. And I, I had it on my wish list. And yeah, really, really happy love it so much it smells really beautiful i'm just gonna make it for now 